Out. Between innings, we talked with Dave Rigetti, Jeff Samarja's pitching coach, and asked him what the organization saw to bring Samarja here after a rough year last year. For our GM and our uh, front office, you know, that's not part of my job, but I think they saw the innings. The, our bullpen really got beat up the last year, and uh, we needed some innings badly, and um, so that's what they did. They, you know, they brought in the Zimmermans, the Cuetos, the Samarjas, the Grinkies, the people that they, and they made an effort that they were going to do that. Yeah, it's been nice to have those additions. What about yes, in sir. particular, or particularly what you have done with Jeff Samarja? Bruce Bochy was telling us a little bit about the arm angle. We're seeing sure. him use more cutters. What did you do with him once you got a hold of him in spring training? CJ, it's, uh, you know, you guys are all built a certain way, and Jeff's always been comfortable turning on the mound. And, but you got to be really careful with what you do when you come back out of that turn. Johnny Cueto does it as good as anybody. You get that front arm back up and work over the ball. So you got different angles and not always on the same plane. And so it's it's really big his timing coming out of that turn and how he finishes. Otherwise, every pitch is just going to be running towards a right handed hitter. Right. We appreciate the time, Dave. You're welcome, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Very interesting there if you sometimes people have a hard time following some of the pitcher jargon. But basically what he was talking about with Jeff Sabarja was trying to eliminate some of that body turn to get him a little bit more consistent. He felt like if he turned a little bit too much in the way that Cueto does, and Cueto probably turns uh, more than anybody, maybe since we've seen Hideo Nomo as far as how much of a turn he has in his delivery. It sounds like they tried to limit that a little bit to get him in a better position.